Derek Jeter played his last home game at Yankee Stadium Thursday night, September 25, and it was an event to remember. It's never easy to say goodbye, but it was especially hard for Yankee fans to send off the captain, perhaps the greatest player to wear the pinstripes in the modern-day era. Tickets prices to see Jeter's last at-bat in the house that he built rose to an unprecedented $845, despite the inclement weather. It was a packed house. Even Jay-Z made sure he was in the building to see the great one's last era. Derek Jeter capped his Yankee Stadium farewell with a game-winning single in the bottom of the ninth inning, the latest, and perhaps last, storybook moment in his charmed and illustrious career, to give New York a 6-5 victory Thursday night over the Baltimore Orioles. Serenaded with adoring chants that echoed through the Bronx night. Jeter tipped his cap several times at shortstop and drove in three runs. He launched an early double off the left center wall and saved the best for last, a sharp, opposite field single to right that knocked in the winning run. During the raucous celebration that followed, Jeter said he's played his final game at shortstop, but he'll likely play in some capacity this weekend in Boston. It appeared Jeter's tea-breaking grounder in the seventh would be the swing that sent the Yankees to a victory when they built a 5-2 cushion against the Alley's champions. Nope, he's always had a flair for the most electrifying kind of drama, and this night was destined to be no different. As if it was planned all along, closer David Robertson, 4-5, gave up a two-run homer in the top of the ninth to Adam Jones and a tying shot to Steve Pierce with two outs. That only set the stage for Jeter one more time. Jose Barilla hit a leadoff single in the bottom of the ninth against Evan Meek, 0-4, and advanced on Brett Gardner's sacrifice. Jeter lined the next pitch through a huge hole on the right side, and pinch runner Anton Richardson slid home ahead.